pictures. I'm getting it right now. Alright, What's good with y'all young boys, man? And females too. What's up to all the vets? I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know what I'm doing today, if I'm being real. I just woke up, which is fucking insane because it's 3 o'clock. I woke up like an hour ago, bro. I need to get my seat charger back, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of wanted to make like a little update video, you know? A little update video talking about what the fuck I've been working on. I don't know what it is. I've had this shirt for a minute, but I just been like, I y'all know I fuck with the oversized shirt, right? But like, just to fit on this, like I'm gonna always have a fashion sense for some shit. Just, um, I had cut the sleeves, cropped it. And just the fitting of it on me is perfect. And just like this color code in general with the shorts. God damn. I just fuck with the simple shit like this. Like simple shit like this, I fuck with. So I'm just like, why not let me sit down, talk to y'all about what the fuck I've been working on and what I've been doing in life in general. Cause I'm low key out of that stage of like trying to do Q and A's and shit. That's like, it's nothing wrong with that. But I just want to talk to y'all more in depth about what I got actually going on. So it's kind of gonna be like an update on my life, how I'm doing and shit like that. I think I'm going to the thrift store later with my dad. I don't know if that's 100% or not. So we'll see about that. But new pickups this video possibly. I don't got no cut or nothing like that. But I'm low key. I'm I ain't gonna lie. I'm low key. I've adapted to the. Um, um, the caveman look, bro. It's like, fuck it. It is what it is. But I can't magically just cut my hair. So it's like, I'm just adapting, bro. This is me. If I'm being honest with y'all, bro, the main things I've really been focused on right now, content. My bad, y'all. I got a phone call. But the main things I'm working on right now, it's content, obviously, YouTube, Twitch. Those really like the main content for when I'm trying to like lock in with 100%. Y'all know I've been... Locking on the YouTube shit, but Twitch. I said this a minute ago, but like, bro, at some point it was like I felt a crazy disconnection because I knew Twitch was something I always wanted to do. But if I'm being completely honest, bro, like YouTube and Twitch is completely fucking different. YouTube, you can like edit, pre-record, Twitch, everything is just on the spot live. Like you gotta have some shit. You feel me going on with Twitch? Like it was a little bit different, but I'm I feel like I'm adapting to it a lot more compared to how it was when I first started. So I'm locking in on shit, content, all that shit. Now I want to talk brand. Now. I wanted to start my brand this year, bro, but just like, I'm a firm believer of trying whatever you want to do, doing whatever you want to do, but just in the position I'm in, it's like, my main focus is content, and I even, I got a close, like, bomb with my manufacturer, so I talked to him about it, talked to him, stuff like that, obviously, he pushed me to, um, still, like, work on a brand as I'm doing the content stuff, which is 100%, like, I, I appreciate him more for doing that, because, like, he just wanted me to be great and shit, so... Shut up my manufacturer on that part, but it's like, I was writing down notes, and it's like, bro, if I want to lock in on content, and then a brand shit is like, I have to be heavy focused on one, bro, because I'm going to have to work on designs, shipping stuff out, Finan really financial shit, I ain't going to lie, like, niggas not rich, so I can't just be getting samples, bulk orders, I'm going to do a pre-order, but I know I still got to get, like, shipping shit out and shit like that, so it's just like, I'm not in the spot where I want to just brand, content, which is all possible, but I want to get to that point where it's like, realistically, it's just too much to um focus on right now. And content is just like my main shit I got going on. So, y'all know I wanted to drop this tea. I probably still am eventually. The three panel joint. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, not doing it the best uh, justice. And y'all don't, bro, y'all didn't even know. I, bro, I had made, so I got a sample in for some joggers too, but the sizing was not the best. I ain't gonna lie. The sizing was not the best, but I had made some joggers, bro. I probably can barely see this shit, but. For me, we had the venture on the shoestrings. Call it like, bro, I got one of the best manufacturers. I ain't gonna lie. Quality on everything be amazing. Pockets, zip up pockets. Feel me? Deep pockets, too. You know what I'm saying? So, I can make the clothes, bro. Like, I can make the clothes, bro. I can make the clothes with ease, bro. It's just a matter of being financially stable to just be able to buy samples when I want to, bulk orders, pre orders. Just, just the shit like that, bro. So, you feel me? I'm just coming to acceptance with that. But I know for a fact, like, I can't always drop a brand, bro. Like, this is just not no detrimental shit to where if I don't drop right now, I can't drop at all no time soon in the future. So, you feel me? But it was one of my 2024, um, what is it, resolutions or goals to drop something for the clothing brand. But it's like, I matured a lot. I'm not going to force that. I'm not going to force it within myself. If it's not the time, it's not the time. And time is, time is really everything. So, I'm going to just keep building my shit up. Then when it's time, or I feel like it's time. Boom, it's gonna be hella drops and pieces that I'ma um, come crazy with on the brand. I just gotta lock in on my financial shit, so that's all it is. Let's talk music. I was working on a tape. I think I said this in prior videos, but I was working on a tape. I'm pretty much done with the tape now. I'm just waiting on the cover art, so once that shit comes to me, I'm immediately publishing that shit into this show, kid, and we're gonna get that shit out and about. And I got a video that's gonna drop on that too, so y'all gonna see that. That video, damn, they're done. Like I said, I'm just waiting on the cover art to be honest. I'm motherfucking going out, so that's really what I've been working on, bro. I ain't gonna lie, like. 
Now I'm too crazy. I wanna give y'all I wanna I wanna just give y'all an update on what I've really been working on. Nigga just working, bruh. Trying to grind every day, get this shit out. Learning a lot within this shit. You know what I'm saying? That's 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 me, bruh. Alright y'all, so it is the next day when I was previously talking in the last couple clips. It's 403. August 27th as shown. In a segment throughout the clips, I said I was gonna go to the thrift store with my dad. I ended up going today, but that was like an hour or two ago. Bag of clothes. I'm about to show these to y'all. And we're gonna go from there. But this is the fit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. This give me back old hoop balls. And I used to actually fuck with hoop in high school, hoop and shit like that. If you a real Jalen Green fan, like bro, you know, like imagine this is a jersey. Imagine this shirt is a jersey. Long jersey. Short shorts, then we got the socks. These are my favorite pair of socks I got. I got a white version of these. I think I ain't gonna lie. Bro, I'm gonna fuck around and make some socks for the brand, bro. Like, I'm telling you, like, it's so much shit I wanna make, but these just comfortable as shit. Like, I'm like, I don't know that many niggas that got these. And the crazy thing is, my grandma gave these to me a minute ago. I don't know nobody that has these, so. You feel me? If you want something, it's gonna say venture across it eventually. But these motherfuckers comfortable as shit. So I'm about to show y'all the clothes. I'm gonna end up for sure editing them a little bit, you know, cut them up and shit like that. Cause I haven't did that in a minute. And some of these need to be cut up and shit. So I'm like, fuck it. Um, but yeah, I'm about to take y'all boys into the living room. Y'all know how I be making the short films, right? I might make this like a little shot. Y'all, I don't know, fuck it. But got the piece of the tripod. I learned the easier way to do this shit. If I take this piece off. And then just twist it onto the camera, which I'm doing right now. Hold on. I know y'all can't see it right now, but hold on. Get the tripod. All I gotta do, y'all see this, right? I don't know why I'm giving y'all the goddamn tripod tutorial. All I gotta do is put this on. Y'all can't see it, but tripod is on. On to the living room we go. All right, y'all. So here we have it. Shout out my dad, too, for taking me to the thrift store, man. Bro, I haven't got a good thrift run in in so long, bro. Shit been tragic, bro. I'm not gonna lie, but four items. And this wasn't like Savers or Goodwill or nothing like that. It was like more of like a high-end thrift store, so shit was okay taxed, so I couldn't go too crazy. But we got some good items for sure. If y'all in my state and want to know where it's at, this is it. And they got like these cool with, like vintage tags on each of their pieces, which is hard as hell. I fuck with that. Now with the first item, I already took the tag off. I'm not gone. La. I've been fucking with hats. I know a lot of y'all probably gonna be like, this nigga got a Mickey Mouse hat. Listen, I've been fucking with the caps, bruh. Simply because my hair is a lot longer now, and they go with more shit, so I'm like, fuck it. What, Disney John? No, I'm pretty sure somebody got this from Disney World. I'm pretty sure. That's the good thing about the thrift. Like, the backstory behind shit be so crazy. And this is the inside of the hat. I like this kind of, like, foam to it. Do it fit the best? Not crazy, but I'm fucking with it, though. You feel me? This type of vibe I'm going for, old school type of vibe. A lot of y'all probably can't resonate with this hat, but like, yeah, you know I'm saying, and it can't. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna say it can't fit on my hair for real, but once I adjust it, wear it a little bit more, sure gonna be perfect. But I really just fuck with the vibe, with the making. Y'all gonna see the other reason why I got it too. I'm about to go ahead and show y'all the other reason why I got it. I ain't gonna lie, like, like fuck it, right? Fuck it, right? You know what I'm saying, fuck. It. Oh yeah, this is the tags y'all was talking about. They got like these vintage like older cards i think this is a baseball player baseball player and then it got like i just fuck with shit like this it's like an older vintage kind of vibe i fuck with that shit so <laughs> uh -huh. tight shit tight shit y'all yeah, probably can't really see the material but like it's like a it's not the material to like it's soft i don't know how to explain it but it's like a thicker material and i fuck with it y'all already know these scuffs is getting cut off immediately like this i'm gonna try everything on at the end this really why i copped it and if i'm being honest my dad had found this hat for me. I ain't gonna lie. Like, my dad, I ain't even found this hat. When I was shopping with my dad, he had found this shit for me because I had this top. So I'm like, fuck it. And then I copped this long sleeve. I don't know what it is, but I've been fucking with the long sleeve shit, bruh. And another thing, it is about to be winter and fall, so it's gonna get a little bit more chillier, bruh. So once that time it come, these type tees gonna be perfect, bruh. Like, no cap. And if y'all seen the beginning of the video, I literally had on a long sleeve. I'm leaning more towards the long sleeve kind of style. Rocking out like that, but shit's getting cut off. I don't rock with the scuff no more. I'm not gonna lie. Angle, I can barely read this shit myself. I'm pretty sure it says Getsyberg Bicycle. Like I said, I might be completely wrong butchering the name. My bad. It's the Getsby shit. Y'all probably can't read it, but it's the same shit that's right there. Same thing on the other side. So, you know what I'm We copping the long sleeves, bro. If you're not rocking the long sleeve, swag, pullover, long, whatever you want to call it. What are you doing? And then we got this one. I ain't gonna lie. I know, like I said, nothing really belongs to you. I'm not gonna lie. I was gonna cop some jeans, bro, but I'm like, I really don't need no more jeans in my collection, if I'm being honest. I got every color of jeans that I need. Hella blue denim. I got a good player of black, gray, whatever. I got it. So I'm like, I don't need no jeans. It's gonna be a waste of money. We got this one. Now, if I'm being honest, I really just fuck with like the font and like it's like a red on pink type of swag to it. 
But the thing about this one is, I know this one gonna be like a, a crop kind of fit. I'm not gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. This might fuck around and be a girl shirt. I ain't gonna lie. This might be a girl shirt, woman shirt. Just, just by how the way this shit fit. I probably can't really see it through the camera, but like, it's like a tinier fit, but I know I can fit this bitch. It might just be a little bit skin packed to the body, but it motherfucking be able to fit for sure. But I really just fuck with the uh, font, red on pink. Shit font is fuck, so I'm like, fuck it. Pit this shit up. I wanna say shout out to my dad, bro. My dad actually bought me the clothes. So like I said, shout out to my dad, shout out to my dad. Like I said, I got the best parents of all time. I'm pretty sure the only thing I'm gonna do to these clothes is just cut the scuffs off. Cause like I said, I don't know what it is, but when it comes to like pullovers, long sleeve, I don't really fuck with cropping the bottom, bro. This don't look too appealing to me. I ain't gonna lie, that's it's personal. But like I said, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna just cut the um scuffs off and that's probably what i'm gonna do to all of them so let me hop into that real quick and then i'm gonna try everything going for y'all i've come to a custom of a lot of hoodies or long sleeves come like this like it's gonna be pre-scuffed so i've learned a lot that i'm gonna have to do this shit a lot frankly i don't know what it's come to or like what made me start doing it but i just fuck with like i did it for one of my pieces and ever since then it's like i gotta do it for the rest of them bro i ain't gonna lie just the flat look and then a little bit of distressing at the end of it just looks amazing bro First sleeve completed. On to the next. Yeah, uh, okay. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a star player. I don't need no substance. Ain't no better time than I've been. But you better like it. I've been in my head too much. Mama said I'm already young. If you think I'm past the ball, you stupid. Dunk a butter round. I've been in my head, bitch. I feel like sorry you. Let me tell you about my lifestyle. This shit can't get real, okay? That's pretty much it for me for the day. I don't know. Sometimes I'll be feeling like when videos, if, if it's just me in the crib, literally the whole video is like, is it? Do y'all really fuck with the video? But then it's like, I gotta stop overthinking shit because you never know. Um, Let me know how y'all feel about the pickups. Was it worth it? WL. I love y'all, bro. I know at the beginning of the video, I was just telling y'all like a little update on what I've been working on and shit like that. Just trying to figure this life shit out. A lot of learning and shit that I'm going through. So we just life. Life just life. And so I don't really got too much to say about that. But I love y'all, bro. If you support me, if you watch a video, like a video, watch a video for one second, you tune into his Twitch stream, you seen a clip of me from Twitch or whatever, I appreciate you, bro, because without you, if you watching this video, big head ass nigga, I love you, bro, no cap, and if nobody believe me, you just know what I do, man, but, but you want this out, man, y'all keep going for me, I'm keep going for y'all, shout out the fucking vet, if you're not a vet, and you're watching this video, what the fuck are you doing here, bro, get your big head ass out of here, but nah, everybody appreciate it, I love you, bro, I'm out.